Hi guys, and welcome back for another Property Fi Home Tour. I'm your host, Broker Ed, and today I'm gonna show you a very low key house located in Alfonso Cavite. And to be specific, this house is situated in one of the biggest subdivisions dito sa Alfonso Cavite. Kani nag, nag breakfast ako doon sa Twin Lakes. It only took us around 2 minutes drive and then nandito na ako sa subdivision. Let's go! So upon entering the main property, you will be welcomed by your car garage. And sorry, pero nang yung doging maingay. So actually, this car, uh, car garage, it could fit at least two cars. And then, sitting behind me is the main door of the house. Now you've seen um, the car garage and the main door of the property. But before we tour inside the property, dito muna tayo sa labas. Actually, we have a roof deck. Pwede siyang i-access through the car garage. So, ito. Let's go up. This is the roof deck of the house. So, pwede nyo to i-convert into for, uh, another floor. Or pwede, ano lang siya, common area. Like, if ever you have um, gatherings or party, so pwede itong gawin. So, as of the moment, we have this stock room. So, dito muna nilalagay yung mga ibang staff. So, now, after seeing the facade, the car garage, the main door of the property, and the roof deck, now we'll go to the main house. So, but before we start our tour, please don't forget to hit like and subscribe button. Also, please do hit the notification bell so that you will be updated in all our Property 5 home tours. Also, please do follow our pages, Facebook at Property 5 Philippines Inc. and Instagram at Property 5 PH. So now, super excited na ako to tour you inside this low-key house. So upon entering the main property or this beautiful house, you will be welcomed by this open layout. So when you upon entering, and dito na yung kitchen area, which is fully equipped. Actually, for example, this island counter, this is made of German white, and then this countertop here, made, this is made of quartz. So lahat ng mga items, especially yung mga heavy duty appliances, galing to sa states. Meron tayong dishwasher dito sa kitchen din. So everything you see dito sa kitchen, it um it is included in the sale na. So see? On this side, we have this entertainment area. So we actually we have three TVs, actually four parang meron din sa baba. So this is one for the um living area. And then across the kitchen, dun malapit sa main door, you have this guest area here. Mga materials that they use here, mostly woods that are made of acacia and mahogany. So, ito. Ito yung isa sa mga highlight dito. Um, dito, sa pababa, this is the formal dining area. So, if you have visitors or gatherings, you can do it here. And then, if napapansin nyo dito, meron tayong door. So, if ever we have some gatherings or mag celebrate tayo ng, ng important occasion, um, the, the visitors pwede nang mag-direct access dito sa formal dining area. Um, okay nang hindi na sila dumaan doon sa living area and sa kitchen area natin. So as you can see, these countertops are made of quartz. Then we have here um, multiple overhead cabinets. If napapansin nyo, parang it's super quiet din. Kasi the window glass are made of double glaze. So, itong other door, um, actually, we have two floors here. This is the ground floor. And then, this access, isa to sa access going sa lower ground floor. So, later, I will show you kung ano ba yung meron tayo dun sa lower ground floor. But now, dito muna tayo mag-tour. Moving forward. 
This is made of ano no happy shells. Hmm, cute. So this door, ah, ito yung powder room. So it comes with the sink, under sink cabinets, mirror, at saka toilet bowl. Then this door naman, this will lead you to the lower ground floor. So we have two access going to the lower ground floor. Um, this one and yung kanina na pinakita ko. So now let's head to the master's bedroom. So along this hallway, we have this mini entertainment. So um, yung, yung owners, dito daw sila nanonood pa minsan kapag gusto nila na um, iba naman yung position nila kung saan sila manonood. Then this sliding door, this will lead you to the master's bedroom. So upon entering, makikita natin yung walk-in closet. We have one refrigerator on the end. So on our left, pagpasok ng sliding door, this is the master's bedroom. And then with this huge TV na 57 inches. Then we have this vanity area dito. And then we have this huge bed. Actually, kanina pagpasok ko, sabi ko pa parang may medusa-medusa dito. Um, these are mahogany roots pala. So, yun. Mag ang ganda nung ano, ang cozy nung bedroom, ang cozy nung bahay. Plus, if nakita nyo, parang Spanish-inspired talaga yung bahay. And saka, ang maganda mag-relax dito kasi nga wala akong naririnig noises from the outside because of those windows na in-upgrade. So, this door naman dito, this will lead you to another walk-in closet or your full bathroom. So, you have this shower, you have this his and her sink with mirrors and your toilet. So, actually, nakikita nyo, ba? Sobrang low-key talaga. Iba talaga yung feel pag nakita nyo yung nasa facade pa lang tayo versus pag nandito na tayo sa loob. So, now, since natapos na tayo mag-tour dito sa ground floor, um, I'll tour you naman now kung ano meron dun sa lower ground floor. Let's go. So now, it, ito yung ano, yung sa formal dining area. So now, we're going to the lower ground floor. Ganda, ang daming plants. So we're now at the lower ground floor. So pagdating natin, we have this mini gazebo. So kung gusto nyo tumambay inside, pwede naman kasi cozy talaga. But if you miss the fresh air, this is actually the guest area. So we have this guest room here. Pasok tayo. Upon entering, this is the guest lounge. So pwede tayong tumambay dyan. Plus we have cabinets here. Then this hallway, there are two guest rooms dito sa lower ground floor. So let's take a look on this one muna. So... This one has one bed, and then actually, in expect ko, kanina sabi ko, pwede naman sana window type, pero yung aircon natin speed type. And then this bedroom comes with a toilet and bath naman. This is the second guest room. Actually, same lang siya, identical siya sa kapila. You have this um, bed, yun nga lang, bank bed tayo dito. And your toilet and bath. So, same layout siya. Identical lang sa kabilang room. So, if we go straight on the end of the hallway, itong room, sorry, mali. <laughs> itong room, this is a storage area. Actually, pwede ding servant's quarter. And then, lastly, this door, this will lead you to the utility area. So, nandyan yung washing machine. Tapos, if nakikita nyo yung stairs, dyan sa screen, silip lang. Yan, stairs, dyan yung kanina yung beside the powder room. So, we have this utility area here for wash washing. And then, meron din tayo inside. So, ngayon, labas muna tayo ng guest. Ayun. You ready? So, the guest house. 
And then going back here sa Tambayan area, we have this cabana, we have this swing, then we have a griller here. So kasama na to when you purchase the property kasi ito naman galing US na naman to. So most most ng mga heavy duty appliances galing talaga sa US. Then this is the um kitchen. Dirty kitchen or dito yung ginagawa yung mga heavy duty na gawain or cooking. Yan. So itong door na to, this is another toilet and bath. Tapos another refrigerator. Tapos meron tayong ditong um, utility area ulit. So iba yung nakita natin washing machine dito. Iba din yung washer dryer na dito. Then at the back dito, going back there, this spiral stairs will lead you to the servant's quarter or driver's quarter or storage. 